Hi strangers, yes it's another shopping day today and we're going to go and take a look in HomeSense and I'm hoping to find some things for the bathroom, the picnic basket or the garden so yes let's go and see if there's any sales and see what we can get today. So let's go shopping. So let's go in and find out what we can find today. So we're starting off by looking at all the flowers and plants in, in the store today. I am looking for things to go into my skull planter and I am looking for just some beautiful green things to go in my bathroom. And I was looking actually for some either fake ivy or something that's long and big and long for my pots. Also while I was in here I thought I'd look to see if I can find any picnic plates or bowls or cups because I am looking to replace the ones that originally came with my picnic basket. So I thought I'd have a good look around at the garden bits as you guys know that I am also doing that at the same time. I really love the idea of these big high like stands for pots to go on onto to make them higher and some of wheels on to wheel them around as well which is a great idea i'd prefer them not to have metal bottoms though because obviously if it's going to get continuously wet metal is probably not a great idea and of course you know i am always on a bargain look around and they had lots of things that were reduced in this section Lots of different kinds of flowers, but they were all very colourful. I was so tempted to get this cute little hanging pot here with some plants in. They had lots of broken pots as well, which I thought was a great idea because there are some things I would just like to take the plants out of anyway. I had a look at some garden tools as well which were reduced and yeah I'm not too sure still on buying these because they're quite expensive still for um, £12 and I think I'd probably be better off using a saw in my garden for the bits that I need to cut. Lots of bargain pots down here. I could have walked out of here with so much today. They had some giant Easter eggs as well that made me smile. This I really loved as well, but it wasn't as reduced as I wanted it to be. But still, I really like these leaves. I decided to look to see if they had any more reduced um, things that I could get here as well. They had some olive leaves and the rest were just quite bright colours so I kind of left them sitting there. I thought this was really cool, there was like grow your own mint here and a couple of like make your grow your own plant pots in the back here which have seeds with them which is also a really great idea. I really wanted to make this um, bird house into a goth house but I decided I've got enough going on at the moment to um, think about that as well. They had so many different kinds of bird houses here and I've always really loved bird houses. Right a quick look at the pots. There is no way I'm going to be able to carry them home though sadly they are very heavy. And so many garden things in here today. This shop is always changing its stock daily, so it's really hard to try and, like, you always have to come in here to see what's here. And of course, you know me, I'm waiting for that Halloween season to begin. I can't wait, I'm so excited for it. So these ones weren't reduced, these were quite expensive. So let's have a look at these. I really liked this hand 
one um i could thought about painting them one black and one white or something for my beetlejuice themed garden time to go look to see if i can find some picnic um, basket items next lots of ceramics in here i'm not sure ceramics will be a good idea for my picnic basket because it probably will get broken so i'm checking out to see if i can find anything that's plastic and now i'm going to look at the glasses i couldn't find any plastic in here at all they always have really nice painted glasses in here So yes, I had lots and lots of pots and pans and bits and bobs, but nothing that I could find for the picnic basket, sadly, today. I love this massive, massive bowl. I'm not sure if it's a bowl or a cup. There's an octopus at the bottom holding it up. So pretty. Really cool vases as well. I tried to have a really good look around to see if I could find anything else in the sale or anything else I, I would like. Of course, I had to go and look at another clearance area down here at the back to see if they had any bits and bobs. There was a few Halloween items a few months ago still left from Halloween and yeah, it was stuff that was all broken, sadly, so but nothing in here today. So let's go upstairs. Upstairs they have lots of different things as well, like there is. There's a pet area and there's a place where there's loads of cushions. So yes, let's go and check that out next. A really massive painting that and, and it wasn't a bad price either, but all I could see was repainting over that. So as you can see, there is a pet area as soon as you get up the top of the stairs, which has this massive cat tree. I've been planning to make a cat tree with my daughter, but thinking about making a really cool, obviously goth related with a coffin and a little climbing area for the cats for Dexter and Binks. If you know me, I'm always looking for picture frames and things for my house. I've got so many prints that I need to put in frames. And again, they only still had this round one that I liked in here today. But they did have quite a lot in sale, as they normally do. I love looking at all the like little shelves they do in here and things. And some of them are very odd, because they're just like frames. And again, I wanted them, but I probably wouldn't be able to carry them home on my own. Okay, so we have some more reduced stuff here. We have some clocks and some smaller picture frames here. And I really wanted this massive um, sand timer here. Oh, it's got another name, but I've forgotten what it is. But I thought it was amazing. I would love to have that. It was slightly broken, I think, at the top.
but yes can, can you just see all the clearance stuff it was just amazing I love clearance stuff okay let's look at some more stuff for the bathroom so I had lots of bath rugs and things I'm trying to find something that's going to match the bathroom I did find this black and white like loafy feeling um, mat for the floor but I'm not sure if that's going to go and then this stripy rug and it had this random black extra patch on top again I don't think it's going to go with my skulls and I kind of had an idea of what kind of rug I wanted to get for the bathroom and I desperately need a new toilet brush I want broke and yeah so I thought I'd look around at them today since they're all in sale toilet roll holders I thought was a great idea I do need one of them I normally just keep my toilet rolls in a bag because it's in a waterproof safe place but a toilet roll holder would be a good idea these I really liked as well I was very tempted to this it was very heavy and yeah not a bad price either I'm sorry if we go eight pound my camera is having lots of hard job trying to focus on things then I saw this this I thought was a really good idea because I've got nowhere for my toilet roll to go on to and I hate the wall one the whole wall mountain ones and um, yeah I was tempted to buy that it again it was quite heavy because it was weighted at the bottom Lots of random reduced bits here and some things I'd never really thought about before. I thought this was quite cool and yeah there's lots of like shower caddies I think they're called and they hang over the top of the of your shower which I thought was a really good idea. I've never really thought of that before. Again some more bath rug, rugs there or mats. So many ideas of other things I can get for the bathroom now. Okay, let's have a look around and see if they've got any more sales. Or any more bargains for us to get. They always have so many dog toys in here and things for the pets. I think it's great. And I'm always looking for cat beds for Dexter and Binks. I thought this was really cool. I keep seeing on Timu like they have this cat like carpet that you can stick on the wall so they can climb up the walls. So they did have some in the clearance here and yeah they're all very like pastel colours and then I saw this really cool like dog and it was like made out of metal and it was made to look like a rusty a rusty bed which I thought was really strange but really cool as well. Okay they had some DIY stuff down here which I got quite excited about after looking back at the animal shampoos and I noticed some spray in the back and I got excited thinking that I might have some varnish so I had a good look around but I couldn't find any lots of toolboxes and lots of cleaning bits they had as well and they had reduced car things here I 
and I was on the search now to try and find some paint because I did see a tin of paint there. Because there's nowhere to buy tins, tins of paint from anymore in town and I'm always looking to see where I can buy some. They had a reduced brush here. So yes, yeah, so much stuff in clearance and so much stuff reduced in price, which I love. They even had reduced towels and blankets here. And of course I had to go and look over at the art supplies in here. They always have a big range of pens and pencils in here. And I do love to draw as you guys know. I love walking around this part of the shop because you find all the scented candles and things and it smells so nice. It had lots of reduced lamps as well in here and I thought I'd go and have a look at the clocks. So yes, I did get some bits and bobs. I will take these home and I will show you what I got later on. Yes, I am back. Not home. Yes, I'm going to show you what I got from the shop today. So I have got a big bag here. And I did get some things, so let me show you what I got. I got this which I thought would be really helpful for the bathroom, for cleaning up the tiles and things. Never had one of these, I thought it'd be fun. I think it needs lots of batteries though. So, I'll open the box to show you what it looks like. It's like a giant electric toothbrush. <laughs> so yes, I have a big toothbrush. No, it's not a toothbrush. And also, in the bag, stuck. I got this plant for the bathroom. I thought this might fit in the skull head, so I'm hoping that's gonna be his funky hair. So we're gonna check that out. something really exciting now yes a toilet brush and I got it because it was reduced it was only £2.50 so bargain and the last thing I got was some garden gloves so if I'm sawing down the ivy I won't get sore hands anymore 
and that's everything I got at the shops today. If you liked my video, then please don't forget to subscribe because that helps me out a lot. And don't, don't forget, be weird, be yourself, and be different. Because otherwise, you're just boring. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.